I was extremely upset to hear about the news of the death of Captain Mahama. Um, uh, to me, a complete waste of life, a valuable life, in circumstances that do not do not do no credit to anybody. Very very sorry to hear about it, and I'd like to extend my sincerest and deepest condolences to his wife and family. I asked the uh, Vice President to go and visit with the family, and I believe today my own wife, Rebecca, has been also to console the, the widow. One thing which is clear, I've told the law enforcement agencies, the law investigation and enforcement agencies, that they should spare no stone make sure that those who were responsible for this brutal act are brought to face the consequences of and brought before trial in our courts and justice done accordingly. We have to have a country where the rule of law works. I've been fighting for that all my life, and now that I'm in the chair, I have to make sure that there is meaning to it. I've had to, to do uh, something uh, with some considerable reluctance, but which I felt was necessary to do. The district chief executive uh, made comments in this matter that uh, appeared to have been somewhat provocative. Um, taken the decision that uh, he should be suspended pending an inquiry into all the circumstances of the matter and the comments that he, uh, in the meantime, directed the Minister for Local Government to take the appropriate measures to carry out this decision.